Spiders just got a little creepier, as scientists from Rice University in Texas have hacked arachnid biology to turn them into what they call necrobotic grippers. Ugh. The study had humble beginnings as assistant professor of mechanical engineering Daniel Preston and graduate student Faye Yap were setting up their lab and found a dead spider in the corner. The two wondered why spiders curled up when they die and after a quick search found that while spiders can use muscles to make their legs retract, they use hydraulic pressure to make their legs extend. The researchers inserted a syringe full of air into their spider and with a little pressure found that all of the spider's legs opened, which meant that it could grab stuff. Preston, Yap, and the rest of the team call this field necrobotics, you know, necro meaning dead, and illustrated that the necrobotic gripper could move chunks of foam, circuit boards, and even other spiders. The team used wolf spiders in their research and were able to see that the inanimate spider could be used as a gripper through around 1,000 open-close cycles and could lift 130% of its body weight. I can't lift that much, so like the great Frank Reynolds said, when I'm dead, just throw me in the trash. While Preston says that most of his colleagues were supportive of his research and even a little excited to see the gripper in action, some were a little less than excited to be dealing with the spiders. I think that the necrobotic gripper is actually really cool, and it's probably the only thing I'm going to be thinking about next time I see a dead spider in my apartment. To read more about this story, check out gizmodo.com.